welcome back to Enigma Review. So today I'm going to be doing another small independent business. One that I've been searching for over the last couple of weeks. Or should I say, I've been searching quite a few over the last couple of weeks. So it, it may seem like I'm being very quiet when it comes to like small independent businesses. But I've been searching kind of different things and things that I've, I've never really collected in the past that I'm, I'm finding I'm interested in now. So today guys we're going to be doing one small independent business that you guys may not have heard of. Well you will by the time I'm finished. So this one came in this packaging. Now this is only one small item guys and I just thought I would like more from here. I really would like more but I thought I will try them first because I've never really been a fan of these in general but I have seen a lot of people lately like dipping into them and I just thought I do own a few. Maybe I should just start getting them and sticking them on my cart because I do quite like them. So this guys is a parcel that arrived. It's been here for about probably about five or six days. Um, I've got some information but first I'm going to open it and take out what is in there. So it's quite a big envelope for what the item was but I like the fact that she's put it in a really nice purple envelope, which I do like them envelopes. So I put the items in front of me. I should have said the item. She has sent me a, a card as well to explain a little bit about what it is that she does. Right, guys. So today we're going to be talking. Let me get my notes out for you guys. And it's glitter punk jewelry. Now, I did ask if she had any information to give me that I wanted to add into the review but unfortunately she's not got back to me as of yet so I thought I will do my own little research from what I can see I can't tell you a lot because she didn't have like an about me on there which I thought mm, I would have liked to have possibly tell you guys a little bit about um, the business and so forth but I can see that it, I think she started her Etsy page around about 2015 um, and from what I can see she's done pretty well guys so 20,654 sales she's a five star rating as well and it's an Etsy shop she is on Instagram guys but I don't think I don't think she's on oh she's on Twitter as well guys so she's on Instagram and Twitter now she has given me a list of all her social medias. This is one of the cards that it came, as you can see here. And on this, she has www.glitterpunk.co.uk, which is, I think that's one of her home emails. Then she's got Instagram at glitter.punk, all in capitals. And then she's got Facebook slash glitterpunkjewelry. And obviously at Twitter, it's at glitterpunkjewel. So if you want to pause and grab that information, um, I went straight to her Etsy page and um, that's how I found her and I searched what other platform she was on and I only managed to find as far as Instagram and Twitter. There's a fly flying around me, sorry guys. <laughs> so this is what I purchased and I think the presentation of this is absolutely beautiful guys. And then she's also put me a card in here. So this card says, thank you for your order from Glitter Punk. You're awesome. I hope you enjoy your goodies. Got pics, tag me. So I, I will be taking some pics and I, I will tag um, her in that. And I'll also tag her in the video as well so she gets to see. Um, and it's hashtag Glitter Punk Jewelry. Now, you, you guys might have already tried um, pins and jewelry and so forth from her, um, her Etsy store. For me, it's the very first time. I have no qualms, I've got no complaints. It arrived in super good time. It came in very good packaging. To say it's an enamel pin, it's not really gonna break as such, but the packaging was lovely. I like the attention to detail. I like the fact that she put all the social media platforms on there, a little gifts, and this beautiful pin, which I will open in a minute, guys. So I've also had a look at what she does and it is acrylic jewelry and pins guys now her pins are amazing i will try and pop a couple of pictures up for you to see they vary from cats hugging and then they've got a day and a night cat some most of them vary around seven pound twenty apart from mine guys this one is a little bit more i think i paid what did i pay for mine i think i paid nine pound uh i did write it down 
My pa my pin was nine pound, guys, and it's it's definitely worth nine pound. I've seen lots of pins on her site that I absolutely love. She has a vampire vampire cat enamel pin. Cat bloody tart today. A coffin um, pin as well. Pumpkin with flowers on. There's seven twenty thems. An anatomical heart in two different colours. I think you can have them in different colours as well. You can have these on key rings as well, guys, or you can have them printed onto a cup. She does stickers, she does the jewellery. I just think what she does is amazing. She's got a lot, a lot of pins. Quiet fish, ghost, cat cauldron, trio of cats, patches. She even does patches as well, guys. And she'll also do like a deal where you can get three pins for £26. Or you can get two pins for £18. That, I think, is good going. I haven't looked at this pin yet, but I'm going to take it out and see. And I think that's pretty much all that she does around on her page. I do, she does more pins than anything, from what I can see. But um, I did ask her if she does custom pieces. I mean, for example, would you be able to have that on a necklace? I'd be interested to know because it's a very, very heavy pin. So it's a black with gold enamel, guys, if you can have a look at it there. The card and everything is beautiful. It's like a like a rainbow, pretty glitter effect. I think she does entitle, um, entitle, she does entail glitter as well into some of her pins, maybe some of her work. I mean, this one isn't, but it is amazing. I love the fact that it's got the moon and stars on there. And it's got little pink backs and there's two backs on it as well guys let me just see if i can just oh so the rubber backs guys from what i can see as well she does supply spares now i've got a lovely pin up on my unit there but i've lost all the backs to it so it's nice to know that i can go on there and grab some of the backs so this is the pin guys now i don't have a pin board or anything like that because like i said i don't really I don't really collect pins, but lately I've been getting a fair few pins. I got some from Mr. Kamaluna. I think I got one from DMC Designs. I got one from the Coat Box. And they're starting to build up very slowly. I'm like, when I seen this, I just thought I've got to have that because I really do like anything with coffins, anything with bats, ghosts, pumpkins. She's got a lot of pins. A lot of pins that I may have to dive into very, very soon. But I thought I will just get this one for you guys to see. Now, you can stick a pin anywhere, guys. I mean, I'm going to put this on my coat. That's why I wanted the pins to put on my jacket. But you could actually put it on your jumper. You could put it anywhere. Or your denim jacket. Whatever you've got. Or if you want to have a custom piece, a cut-off denim. Um, I used to have lots of pins on my cut-off denim at one point, guys. And that is the pin out of the packaging. It's a fair-sized pin as well, guys. So for £9, I was happy with that. Some people may think it's a little bit too expensive for pins. I personally think that is it's perfect. I have noticed um, a lot of sites such as Wish are doing like these kind of pins. I would prefer to get it straight from the, the person who's designed it. And I love her design. And I just love the fact that it's come on all, like the card, the little card, like all her relevant information's on there which makes it even better. So guys, if you haven't checked out Glitter Punk Jewelry, I will link everything in the description box, including this pin, which I'm going to put back on my card for now, guys, because I'm going to wait until I collect them all, and then, and then, oh God, losing the back already, I'm going to stick them all in my coat, take a picture for you guys to see. Or I might just buy a black denim jacket and stick them on there, because I'm after a black one. But thank you so much, I absolutely love this. Um, Yes, I'll put all the information underneath. I will take some pictures and I will tag her as well. Now, if she does comment afterwards this video is done, I will put the information what she's put in the description below so you can go and check it out. Okay, guys, thank you for watching. Let's support these small independent businesses, especially at the time that we're having at the minute. And as you can see, small independent businesses do deliver. That's for sure. All right, guys, take care of yourself. Pop a comment on below if you've not joined me. Press that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you see when I upload, which at the moment, Wednesday and Saturdays, but it will be more coming soon. Alright guys, take care of yourself. See you in the next one. Mwah. Thank you, Glitter Punk. Bye for now. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and hit that like button if you like this video, because it helps me out and my channel. Take care guys, and I'll see you on my next one. Bye for now.